dream comes true. You could swim along the river, all the way to the sea. You could fly up in the sky above the clouds and trees. You could plant a flower garden up on top of the moon. You could swing through the jungle all afternoon. Wherever our story takes us, I can't wait to see. Yes, friends, come and read with me. It's online story time. Hello everybody and welcome to online story time at your Grand Rapids area library. I'm Miss Tracy and I'm teacher Missy and we are delighted to have you here with us. We today. are like really delighted. Really really delighted yeah. It's, it is, it's a good day to be in the story time space today. It is. So before we start talking about that <laughs> thing we're going to talk about today, should we sing? I think we should. Storytime friends, would you please sing with us today? And remember, if you're not clapping your hands, you can clap anything you've got. Here we go. If you want to hear a story, clap your hands. If you want to hear a story, clap your hands. If you want to hear a story, if you want to hear a story, if you want to hear a story, clap your hands. And I so want it. It just warms me up. So what do you want to talk about today? Well, you know what? This is, this, these things are amazing. I know, right? They, they are so amazing. We as people collect things and have to throw things away and we're messy. And where does all this stuff go? Well, you put it in a garbage can and then it miraculously leaves, right? It disappears by the help of the garbage truck a garbage truck i often think that garbage trucks might be the most important vehicles except for ambulances on the road absolutely because if we didn't collect and haul the garbage away can you imagine it would be piled up all over just think about your kitchen garbage story time friends and how in a single day you can fill up that whole can full of garbage, and of course, you've got your recycles that you put in the recycle, but I'm just talking about the garbage today. You fill up that whole can, imagine if you didn't have any place to put it. And I know you're saying, yeah, but we take it out to the big can by the garage, but what happens when that gets full? Yeah. We have to be so grateful for the garbage truck. And that's, yeah, that is a super important job, and I think probably a really hard job, you know, you know, they have to make sure that the, the big tubs get where they have to go. Some of the trucks have automatic um, where they, lifters now that will lift the garbage can and, and put it. But some of them, they're still jumping out of the truck like this guy and taking that. And that's a huge garbage yeah. can. And then dumping it into the, into the garbage can. And then where does it go? Well, it ends up at a landfill. Some people might call it the sanitation place. Um, but it ends up... We called it the dump. A dump. <laughs> yep. That's where it goes. And then even when it's there, sometimes it gets processed into other right, things into other as things. well. Yep. But today, I just want to be so thankful for the garbage truck. Absolutely. Truck. Don't know where we'd be without them. That's right. <laughs> do you have any good books about garbage trucks? <laughs> what do you think? Hey, Miss Tracy, check this one out. Oh, that's his garbage truck. It is, and it's a huge garbage truck. I wonder if it's in a city or in the country. I don't know. Wow. Um, and it's called Garbage Trucks, because that's what we're talking about today. Um, and it was written by Marv Alinas, and this is an actual photograph. Sure. Yeah, yeah, that's not an illustration. That is a photograph. And that's what you're going to see in this book are photographs. What are garbage trucks? Well, garbage trucks are special kinds of vehicles. They carry trash away from homes and businesses. Garbage trucks are large. They can carry heavy loads. And look at all the garbage in these cans. My goodness. How are garbage trucks used? Garbage trucks carry lots of trash to the landfill. That's what Miss Tracy was talking about. They leave the trash at the landfill and other machines 
push the trash into big piles. They cover the trash with dirt. And down here in the corner, it tells us this machine is pushing the trash into piles. And sometimes birds and other animals pick through the trash. They're looking for food to eat. When I was a kid, my dad and I would go to the dump on Saturdays and sometimes we'd see bears. Yes, we used to do that too. That was a big outing. <laughs> we didn't have a garbage truck then. Oh my gosh, check this out. Not all trash is sent to landfills. Some trash can be used again. Finding new uses for trash is called recycling. Garbage trucks carry this trash to other places. There, it is stored and it will be sent away and used again. And that machine is putting all those cans into a pile. And this is, they're made out of metal that can be used again. Do you think they, do you think they just fill the can up? No, they have to process. Sure. Yeah, they probably melt them all down and start all over again. So you're not getting anything icky. What are the parts of a garbage truck? Well, in the front, garbage trucks look like other trucks. They have a cab, and that's right here. Is where the driver where people sit is in the cab? I'm sorry? Do people sit in yeah, the Yeah, the driver. The, yeah. The, okay. the driver sits right here, just like they would in a, in a car or in another kind of truck. Um, they have a cab where the driver sits, and they have a large engine. The engine makes power that moves the wheels. The back <clears throat> of the truck has a big box, and that is a big box, that holds lots of garbage. And you can see the box way back here. That is a big old truck. Are there different kinds of garbage trucks? Well, there are several kinds of garbage trucks. Rear loaders open at the back. The driver moves the truck slowly down the street and garbage collectors hop off, and we talked about this. They hop off and um, often on the back. They pick the cans up and the trash bags. They throw the trash into the opening. So here they are doing just that. Other garbage trucks are front loaders and they have metal arms on the front. The arms pick up heavy trash bins. They lift the bins up and over <coughs> the cab of the truck. The garbage falls into the top of the box. The arms lower and the, the bins down again. And if you can see, that's what we were talking about. And that those are those big bins like you see outside of businesses or restaurants. Some garbage trucks are side loaders. They have a metal arm on the side. The driver stops by a garbage can. The arm lifts the can up high and tips the can over. The trash falls into the box. The arm puts the can back down. Well, that is pretty cool. There it is, picking it up and dumping it in. Recycling trucks have several bins. Garbage collectors sort the trash into the bins they might put glass bottles in one bin, they might put cans in another. Are garbage trucks helpful? People need to get rid of their trash. Garbage trucks collect trash and carry it away. They keep our streets and our cities clean. Garbage trucks are very helpful. And we have this same kind of garbage truck in our area because I've seen that. That is pretty amazing. They are helpful. I'm glad we have one. Hey, story time, friends. Teacher Missy, you want to do a flannel board? Oh, I love flannel board. It's flannel time. Oh, yeah, it's flannel time. That's right. And guess what we have right here? Armadillos. See, they're green. Aren't they are green like armadillos. Armadillos but... aren't green? Avocados are. They, they are, but they don't have wheels, Miss Tracy. Uh, garbage trucks? <gasps> yeah. I think here we have one, two, three, four, five garbage trucks. And we are going to do a poem called, guess what? 
You got it. Five little garbage trucks. Here we go. Five little garbage trucks, all painted green, picking up trash to keep the town clean. They work and they work until they fill up. Now one of the garbage trucks drives to the dump, back up. And what kind of a sound, story time friends, does the garbage truck make when it backs up? Here we go. Beep, beep, beep. Can you beep with me? Beep, beep, beep. Rum. And they're at the dump. So how many do we have left? One, two, three, four. Four little garbage trucks, all painted green, picking up trash to keep the town clean. They work and they work until they fill up. Now one of the garbage trucks drives to the dump. You got it. He's got to back up first. Can you beep with me? Beep, 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 boom. There they go. How many are left? One, two, three little garbage trucks, all painted green, picking up trash to keep the town clean. They work and they work until they fill up. Now one of the garbage trucks drives to the dump. You ready? Here we go. Beep, 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 beep. Boom. There they go. What do we have left? One, two little garbage trucks. Both are painted green. Picking up trash to keep the town clean. They work and they work until they fill up. Now one of the garbage trucks drives to the dump. Here we go, you ready? Beep, 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 boom. Finally, one little garbage truck, all painted green, picking up trash to keep the town clean. They work and they work until they fill up. Now this little garbage truck drives to the dump. Ready? Beep. And there we go. And that was a great day's work. Thanks for playing. <laughs> Miss Tracy, this book has the funniest, funniest title. It does, but it's probably true. I think it probably is true. And, you know, we're talking about garbage trucks, and the name of this book is I Stink. And I would imagine that garbage trucks don't smell very good. Right. They're picking up decaying food and, yeah. Well, the book is called I Stink, and it was written by Kate and Jim McMullen. And it comes to us from HarperCollins. And we're going to find out about this. Mm, I stink. Who, who, who am I? I've got lights. Ten wide tires. No, AC, not me. I've got doubles, steering wheels, gas pedals, brakes. I am totally dual up. Know what I do at night? Well, you're asleep. Eat your trash! That's what. See those bags? I smell breakfast. Crew? Get me into the get me to the curb. Lights? Blink. Brakes, squeal. Tailgate, say, ah. Feed me, 
straight into my hopper. Nice toss, guy. Stop! Hopper's full, hit the throttle. Give me some gas. Rev me to, to the max. Engine, roar! Oh, look at that. He's getting ready to go. Okay, hold on, guys. My thumb is stuck today. Doesn't want to work for me. Did, did I wake you? <laughs> Too bad. Pistons? Bring on the cusher blade. Blade? Push back the bags. Squeeze them. Crush them. Mash them. Smash them. Whoa, those bags are way compacted. And that's what they have to do, I think, is squish them down so they can get more garbage in there. Tough birds. Ah, now I have room for alphabet soup. Get a load of my recipes. Apple cores. Ooh, dirty diapers. Ooh, banana peels. Candy wrappers. Eggshells. Fish heads. Gobs and gobs of gum. Half eaten hot dogs. Icky ice cream cartons jam jars, kitty litter, lobster claws, moldy meatballs, nasty neckties, orange peels, puppy poop, quail bones too. Teacher Misty, those are all the letters of the alphabet. They are. Look at that. H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O-P-Q. Wow. Isn't that cool? And I bet there's garbage for every letter in the alphabet. Rotten radishes, smelly sneakers, <coughs> toothpaste tubes, ugly underpants, vacuum bags, watermelon rinds, year old yams, ew, um, extra large t shirts, zipped ziti with zucchini. Oh. Thank you very much, he says. <laughs> What's that? You, you think I stink? Woo-wee, do I ever. <laughs> no skunk ever had stink this bad. Go on, go on, hold your nose. But think about it. Without me? Okay, hang on, guys. I'm dropping the book. You're on a mountain of trasherama. Oh, baby. Look at if he didn't, if those trucks didn't come, look what would happen. Look at all the buildings are surrounded by garbage. Oh, my goodness. Next stop, the river. Lights, flash. Driver, reverse. Get me to the barge. Hear me blast my backup rap. Beep, 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 hey. Beep, 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 out of my way. Hmm. Ready, crew, action. Pins, out. Power takeoff switch, hit it. Tailgate, separate. Up, up, up. Tailgate sweeper, can you see what they're doing? The barge is like a big flat, almost like a raft. And he's stuffing his garbage in there, isn't he? He's putting it on this floating thing. I'm empty, Whew, I'm beat. You're waking up now, but I need some Z's. Back to the garage crew, hose me down and gas me up. See you tomorrow night, guys. And look at, this is a city that's nice and clean because he's been doing this job. Who am I? The garbage 
church truck. That's who. And what an important job he has. Even if he does stink. Hey, story time, friends. Teacher Missy. Yes, ma'am. Anybody want to do a little shaking? Oh, shake, shake, shake. Yes. Teacher Missy, I will give you, how about the seeds in an envelope? If you don't have anything to shake with, you can go get an envelope. You can put some dry beans in it. And don't forget the tape. There you go. And that just makes a great shaker. It does. It makes a beautiful shaker. Yeah. That's right. Okay. All right. So I want you to find something to shake, anything to shake. You can find a thousand different things to shake. Because we are going to do two songs, not one, but two songs. Guess what? About garbage. That's right. Teacher Missy was just telling me she's always dreamed of singing songs about garbage. Who knew? I know. And here we are today to do it. The first one is titled Just garbage. Here we go. Pick up garbage and throw it in the bin. Push it down and stomp it in. Carry the can to the street for the garbage trucks to eat. You think the garbage, it looks like they eat the cans, doesn't it? When the trucks come roaring by, workers lift the cans up high. Garbage falls into the back. Crush it, mash it, smash it flat. I know! Let's do that one one more time. Here we that's go. A, that's a fun one. Is that one? Yeah. Pick up garbage and throw it in the bin. Push it down and stomp it in. Carry the cans to the street for the garbage trucks to eat. When the truck comes roaring by, workers lift the cans up high. Garbage falls into the bag. Crush it, mash it, smash it flat. Whoa, that was a fun one. That was a great one. All right, now we are going to do garbage day. Are you ready? Guess what today is? Today is garbage day. Today is garbage day. Hi ho, the truck will come. Today is garbage day. The bins go to the curb. The bins go to the curb. Hi ho, we're ready now. Today is garbage day. Here comes the truck. Here comes the truck. Hi ho, I see the truck. Today is garbage day. Up. Go the bins, up go the bins, smash, crash, the trash goes in, today is garbage day. The truck goes to the dump, the truck goes to the dump, goodbye to the garbage truck, see you next garbage day. Oh, I love garbage day. Thanks for playing. Hey, story time friends, Teacher Missy. Oh. What a great day! I love garbage trucks. I learned a lot about garbage trucks today. That's right. And you love singing about garbage. I love singing about garbage trucks. That was it's a very good time. time. That's right. We learned a ton about garbage trucks. And then the funny thing about the garbage truck, do you see the word that starts with the S right here? Stink. Yep. He says, I stink. And then we all beeped, I hope you beeped with me. I was gonna say we all beeped together, but maybe you didn't beep. If you didn't beep then, could you beep now? Beep, beep, beep. Because it is so fun beeping together. Hey, thanks. And you know, that's important. It, well, it is because it tells people, it warns people that a big vehicle is backing it's up. Backing up. So you, and you even though they that. have really great mirrors, right. if you are standing right behind them, they can't see They might not see you. Yeah, so and it's you, important. You, you, it, it makes you pay attention to, That's what, right. to what's happening to you. And so it's a great sound. It, it is a great sound. Beep, beep, beep. <coughs> if you hear beeping in the library, that'll be me. Okay? That'll be me. All right, so, but I think now it's probably time to say goodbye. I think it is. Storytime friends, would you sing with us? Oh, it's time to say goodbye to all our friends. Yes, it's time to say goodbye to all our friends. 
Story time is done today. Now it's time to go and play. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to all our friends. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Hey, watch for the trucks. <laughs>